Hello again. Just want to take a second and go over the wiring for the Federal Singular Omega 90. I have the 8001 control head, and so the wiring on this is fairly straightforward if you're just going to be using it for the siren, but if you're going to be hooking up a light bar or whatnot, it's going to be a little bit more complicated. But if you're just doing a siren, all you'll need to hook up are these two right here. These two wires are going to be going to the positive terminal of your battery and then this one on the end is going to be going to your negative terminal. Then you'll need to connect this. It's a 14 pin cable. So that'll run all the way to the back of your amplifier here which will plug in. If you're running a second siren you'll have another cable that will connect this to your second amplifier. Then you will need to connect this plug right here to the positive, the first wire is your positive wire, next wire is your negative, and then these two blue ones here are the speaker leads. Now, if you're hooking up a light bar, you're going to be wanting to use these wires here. These are your primary wires. So your red one here is going to be your primary uh, power source, and then this black one here is going to be your negative, uh, term, negative wire. This, you're going to have a position two and three, or one, two, and three. Uh, two and three, position three, as well as an ignition wire coming out of the back here. So, and then all those will be respectively hooked up to your positive and negative terminals on your battery. There's more wires here because I still have the rumbler system hooked up. So that's uh, running wires to here as well. Um, and then you'll just make sure that your speaker leads are running to your speaker. And then in this case, the rumbler is here as well. But that's just a general look at what you're going to need. If you're purchasing a unit like this, obviously you'll need your control head. You'll need an amplifier. And this might actually prove to be the most uh, difficult thing to find. So when I bought this amplifier, I made sure that it came with this cable, this 14-pin cable, because without this, that you're dead in the water. You won't be able to operate it. So anyway, that is just a quick look at this uh, unit. I hope you found that helpful, and we'll see you again in the next video.